Antonio Brown took his jersey off, left the field, threw his shirt and his gloves into the sand. It was reported that Mike Evans tried to calm him down to no avail. He went into the locker room, bust down. Five seconds. What's up, everybody? It's Kangaroo Black. Welcome back to my channel. I'm just coming on real quick to talk about what just happened with uh, Antonio Brown. You know, the Tampa Bay is playing against the Jets, and they down right now. But Antonio Brown, being the person that he is, <laughs> I guess he done called it quits, man. He took off his jersey pads, went to the locker room. On the way to the locker room, he done took off the T-shirt and threw it in the stand, threw his gloves in the stand and everything else. So I guess maybe he called in a quiz. I don't know. I don't know what happened on the sidelines or during the game to make him do that. But uh, this just looked bad on him and the whole Tampa Bay team. But, uh, you know, Antonio Brown was doing some stupid stuff or saying something stupid. But, oh, well, he always in the media. It's like he just loves attention. But the thing to get me, man, coming into Tampa Bay, Tom Brady took up for this dude, man. <laughs> and I think they was about to let him go before the end of the season. Tom Brady took up for him again, even before he started with Tampa Bay. Tom Brady let the man live in his house for a while, but that's that's just crazy, man. You know, it's just like on a damn job, you know. I go to my boss, you know, putting in good words for you so you can get hired, and then you come out, they hire you, and then you don't have come to work. Come to work, or when you do come, you're causing problems. That look bad on me. So it is looking bad on Tom Brady. It looked bad on Bruce Arians too. But you know, this is going to bring a whole lot of questions to uh, Bruce Arians, to the Tampa Bay Buccaneers. I'm quite sure after this, they done with with uh, with Antonio Brown. And I'm sure Antonio Brown playing career is probably over after this. Because he didn't uh, did too much for the NFL. And you all know all these little uh, sports talk shows or whatever you want to call it. They, they finna lay it on him. But you know what? He did it to himself. I mean, it's like the dude is just ungrateful, man. I mean, you know. I, the dude didn't, didn't have much growing up coming out of, I think he came out of Pennsylvania. He didn't have much growing up. And then he, you know, got all this money making millions. He got the big head. He act like he, he should be the star of every fucking thing. But, oh well. But uh, you can blame this on Mike Tomlin and the, and the Pittsburgh Steelers because that's where it all started at. Once he, he get this stardom, he got the name A.B. and <laughs> the dude turned into a, 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 a totally different person. It's like he had an alter ego, and right now he just living that out. That's all. But oh well, to the detriment of his actions, his career, probably, and most likely, I'm quite sure, it's done. Even though I don't know what went on on them sidelines. I guarantee you his career done because of what he just did today. <laughs> I mean, how can you be so stupid, man? Why can't you just, you know, tell the trainers to take you to the, to the locker room, you know, like you injured or some shit or whatever. But damn, just like the other guy who, who quit during – during the game, I forgot his name, but he quit during the game. And then to hear the story of what happened, his teammates just said, he just said, man, I'm too old for this. This is for the young guys. And he went to the locker room, and that was it. And no taking off no jerseys, no taking off your pads, no throwing your gloves and T-shirts in the stands. Wanting want to get all the attention, wanting all the attention on you. <laughs> A.B. It's a damn shame. He, he, I'm going to just go ahead and say it. A.B. is a damn idiot. He's a fool. <laughs> I just don't understand. I don't know, man, how can you tolerate this dude as a teammate? I mean, for the most part, I thought he was doing good. I thought he had, he was a changed man with being with Tampa Bay. But uh, we all know 
That is him. A B. The man, the myth. <laughs> but anyway, let me get over here, man. Just let me know what y'all think down in the comment section. And uh, I'll talk to y'all later.